In the final years of World War II, Nazi Germany was on the brink of collapse. But while cities were being bombed, scientists of the Third Reich were secretly working on weapons the world had never seen before. Among them was a mysterious project that remained classified for decades. The aircraft history would later call the Horton Ho 229, the world's first stealth plane. In 1943, there were two German brothers, Walter and Reimar Horten, young pilots and brilliant engineers. They believed the traditional airplane design was outdated and that the future belonged to tailless, flying-wing aircraft. They decided to build a fighter jet with a completely streamlined design, faster, more aerodynamic, and with a smaller radar cross-section. In other words, almost invisible. In 1944, work began on the first prototype, Horton Ho 229V1. Its wings were made from a mixture of wood and charcoal, not just to reduce weight, but also to absorb radar waves. It was powered by two Jumo 004 jet engines, the same used in the Mi-262 fighter jet. During its first test flight, it amazed everyone, reaching speeds of around 977 kilometers per hour, faster than most fighters of the time. But the prototype crashed within minutes due to an engine failure. Despite the accident, the Horton brothers continued developing a new version, the Ho-229 V3. But the war was nearing its end, and the Allies were closing in on Berlin. In 1945, U.S. forces entered the secret factory in Gotha, Germany, and discovered the revolutionary aircraft before it was completed. The Americans decided to secretly transport it as part of Operation Paperclip through which most German inventions and scientists were taken to the United States. After the war, the Ho-229 project disappeared, but reports reached American engineers, especially those working for Northrop and Grumman. When the U.S. Base B-2 Spirit or Stealth Bomber was developed more than 40 years later, researchers discovered that its design closely resembled the Ho-229. Radar tests in the 1990s even confirmed that the Ho-229 structure had a naturally low radar signature, meaning it was stealthy nearly half a century before stealth technology officially existed. Today, the original Horton Ho-229 prototype is preserved at the Smithsonian National Air and Space Museum, a testament to genius born amid the madness of war, the plane that never flew in battle but change the shape of the skies forever.